So automation, uh, this is probably the most powerful feature that we have. It's pretty exciting stuff. It gives you a lot of control over how you're following up with leads and it gives you a lot of freedom because this is gonna do tasks automatically for you. Uh, anybody with any privilege will have access to automations. So there are none now, I'm gonna go ahead and create one. And this opens up a pretty, pretty uh, uh, informative form here with a lot of options. So I'm gonna go through them for you. So an automation is something that's gonna happen. Uh, it's an action that's going to happen based upon a trigger. And uh, the trigger is gonna be a day, a time, when we want this action to occur. So first option here is applies to. So I have all new leads, if a lead source equals, if an application equals, if a tag equals. So if I click all new leads, this is going to apply to anything that comes into the system, whether an application puts it in or we add it manually, this automation will apply to it. If I click lead source, uh, this is only going to apply to leads that share the Prospects International source. If I click application, it's only going to apply to leads that share whatever application I, I select. So any leads that come in from these two applications or tag any leads that share this tag that have been marked with this particular tag. So I'm going to keep it simple and just select all new leads. So this is going to happen to anything that comes in. Now, when do I want this to happen? Send on day. I can send it on day one, day two, day three, all the way down to day 60. We can create different tasks that happen on all of these days in the prospect cycle. So I want this to happen on day two, because remember on day one, we're already sending a welcome email from the application. So um, I could send this new leads two emails in one day, but I don't really want to. I want to keep it, keep it uh, light and send them one on day two. Now, what do I want to do on day two? Well, I can send them an email, a text message, or an email and a text message. If I select email, it gives me the option to add a subject and a body of what I want to send them. If I select text message, I get uh, a body field, but I also get a note here. And this is telling us that in order for this to work, uh, the lead has to have a mobile number inserted inside their mobile field. So let me quickly jump out of this here because I want to show you that. For example, if I click here and go into this leads profile, there is not a mobile number here. So the automation will not trigger for this lead. But if I do put a mobile number in here, and save this through, it's going to work. Okay. Also, there must be a mobile number inserted for you as the sales associate because we have to send a text message from a mobile number. So we can alter that here under welcome and my username here, you'll see there's a profile and cell. There is no number for my cell, so no text message automations will work for me unless I put a number in there and I'm gonna go ahead and do that. There we go. Save that through. And now my automations are going to work. But back to creating one. We, were, we selected all new leads. We're gonna send on day two. Our method is going to be a text message on day two, and we're going to say in this text message, hi. Are you still interested in purchasing a piano? I can save this through now. So high five automation successfully created. 
Nice. And here we go. I have one automation here with a body. So I know that for every lead that comes in on the second day, they're going to get this text message. And if I change my mind, I can say, you know what? No, let's edit this. I only want them to get that text message if the lead source belongs to Prospects International. Save that through. And then it's going to alter that automation to only send to that specific source. Now, there is nothing in the subject field because this is a text message. So I can keep creating automations based upon different triggers that take different actions. And I can start to format a really nice automated prospect contact flow here. So as you can see, as you can imagine, this is some pretty powerful stuff. Great way to work our prospects uh, without having to manually uh, do all of this stuff ourselves. So automation, that, that pretty much covers that. Uh,